Hi, it's Dick Groves here at the Oak Studio. They said to me, well, why don't you try some EDM? Don't know what to do. do. Well, I was fortunate enough to have some lyrics laid down by Chloe a few years ago for a song called What To Do. Unfortunately, the pace of the song at the time, which was more pop, wasn't quite fast enough for EDM. So I had to use some elastic audio in Pro Tools and compress the track slightly to get the pace right so that the uh, beats per minute matched up to the song. Let's start with the beat. Just getting that kick drum to sound right is the first job. Now we add the top line and suddenly we're starting to get on the move. Once you've established the groove with the beat, it's time to put some fills in. The bass line is critical with the beat to create the main groove for the song. And really, together these two make the bedrock of the track itself. Then it's time to work on a melody line with a slightly percussive type synth. I'm working on a MIDI line here. So in this track, we're creating both a rhythmic line and a melody line all in one. Forgetting the rhythm guitar. There's also a high synth line in there to add to the full soundscape. So, what I've done here is create a full melodic chord on the keyboard, which sounds like this. Then reverse the sound so the decay actually becomes a build. Then we use that build at the end of the verses to bring the choruses in with a lot of energy. Then we combine that build with other special effects that we have running in tandem, such as... Then when we add those two together, we create both drama and atmosphere. Don't know what to do. Now we're cooking on gas. 